four bright new champs and challengers coming up on America's premier talent challenge, Star Search 91. The comedy champ is making his third appearance, originally from Henderson, Kentucky. Here's Torian Hughes. I've been reading a new book by Shaharazad Ali, The Black Man's Guide to Understanding the Black Woman. In this book, she said it's perfectly okay for a black man to use physical force to control a black woman. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> there's a workable strategy. <laughs> Any brother who's stupid enough to try this had better have that book by his side the entire time. Because we all know how that scene's gonna go down. Yo, baby, I'm in the kitchen, ain't no dishes washed. So what's up with that? What's wrong with you, your arms broke? <laughs> oh, I know you ain't talking to me. I'm looking at you, so I must be talking to you. <laughs> Don't be coming in here after a long, hot day. I've been working. I want to come home, kick my shoes off, wash a little open wind for you. Come in here talking about some dishes not being washed. If you want them dishes washed, you better get in there and bust some suds yourself, because if get washed before I wash them, there'll be a trick to it. <laughs> Girl, I'll kill you. <laughs> oh, no, you didn't. Oh, no, you didn't say you was going to kill me, because to kill me, you'd have to hit me, and you ain't about to hit me. If you ever even think about hitting me first, you better hit the shower, hit the door, and hit the road jack, because I'll be the last thing you hit today. <laughs> No man should ever treat a woman bad because women don't need us, and we do need them. Go to any bar in this town tonight, you'll see groups of women on the dance floor dancing together, no men in sight. That's a woman thing. Song comes on, they like, Donna, Jill, Cameron, that's my favorite song. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> Mary, watch our purses. We're right back. Come on, come on, come on, come on. You will never see men behave in such a bizarre fashion. I don't care how much we like the song, you're never going to see a guy go, Bob, Phil, Pete. That's Buffalo stance. Come on, guys. <laughs> Charlie, watch our wallets. Come on. It's, it's hammer time. And that's my time. Thank you. Thank you, Torian. You can't tell where your challenger lives because she's forever on the road trying to make people laugh. You are her next stop. Please say hello to Bernadette Luckett. Hello. I did something I really hate today. I did. I went shopping. I cannot stand shopping. Whenever I have to buy something, I'll just run in the store. I'll buy what the mannequin's wearing. I mean, she looks happy. She's got a boyfriend there. Give me that. <laughs> Give me the boyfriend. Because I'm single now. I'm getting older. I'm starting to have these recurring nightmares. I become this spinster old maid, like Mr. Drysdale's secretary on the Beverly Hillbillies. <laughs> Chasing after guys like Jethro. <laughs> Scary. I'd like to get married, too. I would. I don't want any children, though. No way. Uh-uh. I want grandchildren. But I've been dating, and you know how it is when you like someone, you develop that little crush on them, and sometimes that little innocent crush takes a sick turn and becomes manic compulsive obsession. <laughs> they're all you could think about. You go to places where you know they're going to be, but you act like it's a coincidence. <laughs> this is your apartment. <laughs> Did you ever have a girlfriend who's your very best friend until she gets a boyfriend? And then you never see her again until they break up? But then you're too busy because you're dating them? <laughs> a lot of my friends go to bars to meet guys. See, I don't think bars are good places to meet men because they don't know how to approach women there. Last time I went to one, a guy did this to me. Say, baby, come here, come here, come here. Like, what am I supposed to do? I did. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Thank you, Bernadette. Good laughs tonight from those two. Here's the decision. Torian Hughes receives four stars. Challenger Bernadette Luckett receives three stars. Torian Hughes. Come on over, young man. Very funny, young man, and that's your third win. How do you feel? Feel great. Well, how would you feel if I told you that just put you in the semifinals? I feel better than great. <laughs> <laughs> he feels better. Okay, we'll see you next week. Congratulations. Next, the junior vocalist and the dancers. The countdown to the finals has begun.